When submitting a tender you will generally be requested to submit with the tender an outline method statement describing how the works are to be designed, procured, constructed and completed and it should refer to the technical specification to ascertain the requirements for each element of works. Generally, within 28 days of the award of a project, the contractor will be required to submit a general method statement describing how each stage of the project is to be designed, procured, constructed, commissioned and handed over. A general method statement should be supplemented during the duration of the contract by detailed method statements that describe how key works, trades, and MEP systems are to be designed, installed and commissioned. In addition to the above, all hazardous work activities should be described by the issue of detailed method statement. Method statements should always be issued to the engineer for his consent. As a guideline, each method statement should be structured and prepared in the following format. 1. Scope of works. 2. Access, egress. 3. Lighting. Safety lighting task lighting lighting. 4. Plant and equipment. General plant and equipment schedule personal protective equipment power working platforms. 5. Materials. 6. Sequence, method of work. 7. Program. 8. Risks and controls. Hazards, risks control measures permits third party protection. Environmental considerations. 9. Technical information. 10. Emergency arrangements. General fire precautions communication. 11. Training. 12. Supervision. 13. Working hours. 14. Housekeeping. 15. Other information. In addition to the foregoing, you should amplify the provisions of the method statements with layout drawings, site plans, design drawings, sequence drawings, craneage plans, and traffic management. Refer to a good method statement template found below which is part of our quality control package. Please subscribe and don't forget to click the bell icon so that you'll get notified every time we post a new video. Thank you.